in Charleston, South Carolina, is bracing for a direct hit and seven-foot storm surge. The storm has recharged, and it's just regained this hurricane status. Now communities along the Carolina coastline, like Charleston, are getting ready by providing sandbags to anyone who needs them. Dr. Rick Knapp used to lead the Hurricane Center, and he's now one of our partners at the Weather Channel. Good evening, Dr. Knapp. Good evening, Nora. Ian is a hurricane once again out over the Atlantic east of northeastern Florida, but it is still affecting the northeastern Florida coastline with winds and rainfall, and it will be near that tropical storm hurricane threshold all the way up until making landfall in South Carolina tomorrow, but then it will be an inland wind and rain event in the Carolinas and in the Appalachians. Hurricane warnings near the coast, tropical storm warnings well inland, and a storm surge warning at the coast. Evacuate have told to do so and be careful of inland flooding from heavy rains. Nora. An important note, Dr. Knapp, thank you.